Hey, what's good everyone? Thunderch here. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I wanted to talk to you guys about a very important topic. And this is the notion of daily spiritual practice. So, first of all, I wanted to just let you guys know, this is on my uh, tripod, so I don't have to hold my camera anymore. And it's just, it's just an amazing feeling. So, yeah, I got this really cheap tripod off Amazon for like 15 bucks, but it's so useful. I mean, it's literally supporting my camera and uh, it's it's flexible so I can just bend it to whatever shape. So right now I have it mounted to my steering wheel. But anyways, back to the topic. So um, the importance of daily spiritual practice and a daily spiritual routine. Now, <clears throat> I've built my own spiritual routine and most people will end up building their own Um customized to what they feel is necessary for their own spiritual growth and I recommend that you decide what you feel is most comfortable for you but the point is that you need to have this routine that you do every single day just like you brush your teeth just like you exercise every every single day hopefully um just like you do anything in a routine like you make your bed or whatever and if you really want to grow in your spiritual journey and if you really want to actually elevate your consciousness and raise your vibration to superhuman levels and to exponential levels, then this is something that you must implement every single day. So I see a lot of people, um, they'll practice, you know, psychokinesis or whatever, telekinesis, and they'll practice like once a week or something, or maybe even less than that, or once every couple days. Now, it's understandable sometimes you get busy and stuff, and so you're not able to practice, but really, you want to practice every single day. And why do you want to practice psychokinesis? Well, psychokinesis is teaching you energy, and energy is, uh, you know, fundamentally what reality is made up of, of. So, if you're connecting yourself to the energy field and really honing your senses, then your vibration is actually elevating. So, that's a very important thing, where psychokinesis is a part of my daily routine and it's mostly aerokinesis so it's mostly me going outside and connecting myself to the elements and notice that I said the elements so I, I usually don't practice inside I don't do like the cheese spinner or whatever because I don't think that there's really much uh, knowledge to be gained from that but practicing aerokinesis and practicing with the trees and the water and fire and stuff like that that is something I do every single day and that's a massive part of my daily spiritual practice so what else is important you know you want to have meditation or something some sort of a meditation habit where you're sitting there in silence and reflecting on your consciousness your thoughts your emotions and that was literally what I was doing right before I shot this, uh, started filming this video because I need to find that inner stillness within me and that peace of mind before I'm able to, uh, you know, project information and transmute and translate information that I've been given to you by the universe. So I recommend that you have some sort of an energy practice and some sort of a um, meditation practice. And that's something that you have to do every single day, regardless of whether it's cold outside, hot outside raining, snowing, doesn't matter, you know, and um, most importantly, you want to connect to nature every single day, that's very vital, because nature is our battery and our source of energy, and we become sick and depressed and low vibrational when we are not in contact, constant contact with nature, so um, a daily spiritual practice is something that, you know, starts to develop, and it just becomes like second nature after you do it for a long enough time and you will start to crave your your spiritual disciplines um and really if you think about it with anything that you want to get good at in life like basketball like i'm a basketball player so that's why i'm using that example or you know any athlete any artist musician they would do the thing that they want to progress in every single day for multiple hours a day so if you truly want to succeed in your spiritual journey this is something that you have to put a priority as and you know you may have to make sacrifices so not going out to party with your friends on a friday because you want to stay home and meditate and you want to dive deeper into your consciousness which that is a beneficial move that is the right move in my opinion so um 
what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a Patreon video and this is going to be only for the people that support me on Patreon. Um, one of the videos that I'm going to be making is my actual routine on what I do every single day, which helps me grow and helps my vibration elevate the most. And this is literally, you know, it's a multiple hour process, but this process elevates my consciousness. It releases, it releases the uh, feel good hormones as well. So dopamine, serotonin, and it really helps me bring myself into a higher vibrational uh, state of mind. And um, I do it every single day. So if you support me on Patreon, then that is going to be one of the videos that you'll be getting. And I'll show you how to make your own spiritual practice as well. So your daily spiritual practice. Um, but yeah, I really wanted to just make this video because I think that the idea of every single person that's on their spiritual journey having this routine that they do every single day um, is vital for your evolution. And there's actually a word that the Hindus use and it's called sadhana, which means daily spiritual practice. So they have a single singular word for this discipline, which is you know, you you evolving your consciousness and it doesn't really matter what form you're using. So some people use a different kind of like different kinds of yogas, um, mudras, uh, like breathing techniques. There's so many different disciplines that you can use to elevate your consciousness and aerokinesis and connecting to the environment is just one of those methods. Now, it's an extremely effective method, but it's just one method. So I just hope that inspires you to really take your spiritual journey seriously and to start uh, implementing it every single day so that way you can reach higher states of consciousness and you will notice that as you do, life becomes a lot better and a lot easier and you start to flow with the universe more. So if you want to support me on Patreon and you want to check out that video, be sure to do so. The link will be in the description. If not, thank you anyways so much for watching. So much unconditional love.